Hey everybody, Dylan Distraction here, coming to you live from Batlantic Studios. Thought I'd do a quick back to the drawing board, talk about comic book show it's on my drawing table versus Hell Road Redemption issue one. The pencils continue. This is a two page spread. This is versus being hooked up to Vulgarian's machine, hits a button, and everything goes crazy and bonkers. So he's uh, immediately pulled into another hell dimension, a sort of um, realm where he has to try to save his protege his former sidekick spine uh if you want to see any of that backstory go to um batlanticstore.com you can get the oppressors volume one and uh this raw edition uh, raw pencil version of uh versus hell road redemption is going to be available to anybody that orders anything at batlantic store or becomes a patron at make comics cool so definitely go and check those out uh, i love drawing these characters I love drawing two-page spreads. This is a big two-page spread action scene. So sit back, relax, and enjoy. And here's a commercial. Hey, everybody. Dylan Distraction here. Just interrupting this YouTube video for a second to let you know that my books are available right now at BatlanticStore.com. If you love creator-owned independent comic books, you're in luck. My comic book's available right now batlanticstore.com go to dylan andrews R and click on the store and you'll be able to get comic books mailed from me to you we got warhood we got cringe we got engraved we got hit and run bunch of great books all creator owned all independent mailed to you go right now batlanticstore.com okay now back to the youtube video and we're back thank you so much for sticking out uh sticking through the commercials i appreciate it uh, I want to be able to just share my work and tell people about my work, but I also want to be able to sell my work because being able to sell my work means I can pay the bills and keep making more work because making comics is time and money intensive. You have to print stuff and ship stuff, and man, printing and shipping is not getting any cheaper over the years. So definitely uh, support my work any way you can so I can continue to bring you awesome videos like this at DylanDistraction.com. And if you want to become a patron, go to MakeComicsCool.com. And if you want me to draw something for you, let me know. Happy to do it. Love working with people. Love collaborating on projects. And, uh, yeah, what am I reading now? Spawn Compendiums. I love that stuff. Uh, I guess they're up to Volume 4, but 1 and 2, Spawn Compendium, are kind of my jam. Uh, I think three's pretty good. Um, and then 4, I don't think I have yet. Uh, I love Unwrapped Editions. They had a bunch of great pencil, raw pencil versions of Batman stories. So I've been looking at a lot of those Unwrapped Editions. And then Noir Editions, which are really, really great. They're the black and white inked versions without the color. So there's a bunch of Batman Noir Editions, too. There's a Greg Capullo one. There's a Jock one. There's a Tim Sale, rest in peace, one. There's a Jim Lee one. There's a Frank Miller one. I mean, you want to talk about the best of the best. You, you throw those names out there, and you're like, oh, yeah, no, these guys are all incredible, phenomenal creators. So, yeah, just reading a lot of comics trying to get a lot of influences and inspiration uh scott coblish um looking at his stuff love his stuff S scott collins another guy i love um howard porter obviously declan shelby paul pelletier those are all creators i'm a huge fan of those eric larson phone book savage dragon archive editions I think those are incredible so yeah just really trying to trying to fill my life with uh, awesome artwork and incredible comic books. Sal Buscema. Sal Buscema is another artist that I just love his Hulk work. I think it's so powerful and so impactful, and I've been reading some of that older stuff too. All right, DylanDistraction.com. That's my YouTube channel, Make Comics Cool. That's my Patreon, Dylan Andrews Art, Batlantic Store, Batlantic Studio.